What else have they thought we'd agreed? Anyway, if we stay at home, they've won, haven't they? Yes, but... Oh. You'll be fine. Look, I need to get out. Anyway, having him to stay makes me feel like a kid again. You don't want him here at all, do you? I don't mean that. It just gets uncomfortable. Oh. Dad, you're arguing about me again. Oh, look, Dad, I didn't mean anything. Oh, listen. listen. I want the pair of you out of here. Go and get a drink. Have a curry. Anything. The last thing I want is you stopping in on my account. Here. Right, look, we're not taking that off yet. Look, if you can't go out for a pint because I'm here, then I'll be upstairs packing my bag right away. We are fine at stopping in. It's not easy. I know that. Here, don't you come back less than Mary. All right. Magical Mystery Tour. Right, let's kick start the economy. Stay quiet, and no one will come to you, all right? Don't you talk to me like that. Get out of this house! Don't bring it off the lot of you! Take my advice, mister. Sit yourself down and shut that. You dirty scum. Leave that scum alone! Get your filthy hands off well, it! Well, I thought I told you! Hey! <laughs> I just have to be <laughs> Dad? Dad. <coughs> oh no, Dad. God, Ray! What's it <coughs> It's not as bad as it looks. Well, sit down here and have a look at it. Who did it, Dad? Who did it? Oh, some lads, a bunch of youngsters. We got away with a video. Give us some water, Craig. Come on, come on. Come on. What did he look like? Oh, it was too quick. Just like all the other kids around here, baseball caps and the like of that. Baseball? Oh, I'm glad they like that. I'll go and give them a game. But not now, for Christ. We've got, we've got to get your dad down the hospital. Oh, I'm letting them get away with it. My dad, in my house. Come on, Ray, come on. Now, are you OK to walk to the car? Oh, it's no bother, Now, nice and easy. OK? Errol, it's Gordon. Sorry they got away with your things. Just yeah. matter, it's you that matters. No, I'm but mean will I'm... you wait till later? No! Christ. Keys! Thank you. I mean it, man. Now, We've got to step on them this time. I mean, enough is enough. Yes. Take 
Ian Sonnenberg at Old House on Brickwood Street. But yeah. well, what are we waiting for? Yeah, well, hang on, hang on. Let's not forget why we formed this group, right? Eh? Because the police don't give a stuff, that's why not. That's that's God, I know you're upset about your father, but we need to keep control of this. Yeah, well, you tell that to them. OK, OK, we'll split up and come out from three sides. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Come, on. come on. Roy, that's a lot. Get rid of the rest of the stuff in the pub tomorrow, no problem. The quids in. Yeah, now Gil will think twice before he starts throwing the slaps around. Any more of that, and I'd have given him this. Here they are! Nancy's! What in bottle of sunshine? Oh, yes. Stereo strips over the eyebrows, please, Sandra. Now, have you been suffering any dizziness or feelings of nausea? Well, Doctor, I don't feel too bad. A touch of the old indigestion, but apart from that, no. Well, there's no sign of concussion, so that's good. But uh, you have been in hospital recently, am I right? Mm. Yeah, I had a bit of a stroke, that's all. Right. Well, as soon as we get you sorted out, I would like to admit you just for a couple of days for observation. Well, I don't know about that. Ray? Just nothing the matter with me. I really do think it's a good idea. All right, all right. I'll take up one of your beds. <laughs> uh, uh, Mrs McCauley, can I have a word with you, please? Thanks. Thanks very much indeed. Okay. Right, Mr McCauley, I'll just get you settled and then I'll go and get some stove strips. I've got to find my husband. Tell me, have you reported this incident to the police? No. <laughs> no? No, we don't report things anymore. Uh, my husband and some other people off the estate, uh, they go round, you know, keep an eye on things, uh, sort out the troublemakers. Well, that, that mustn't get out of hand. Listen, the police are overstretched. You've got to do something, haven't we? Uh, Max, could you show Mrs. McFawley where the phone's are? Yeah, sure, it's this way. Thank you. Oh, boys, turn it over! Turn the car over! What? Yes! yes. About. He's leaving the lanties, isn't he? It's fun and a fan, it's so easy, isn't it? Oh, oh, I'll pack the muscle, Harry! eh? Hey, you! Just give that mouth a rest! Harry! Are you looking for me, Tosser? Looks like you bit off more than you could chew, Mr. Right. Yeah, 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 I don't know, I'll ride on either of four of them. You shouldn't have to fight at all. Oh, I've had one or two battles in my life. When I was brought up, it was really rough. Well, we'd never do anything like that, never. Listen, these boys, they're just not worth thinking about. They laughed at me. That's what I can't get over. Young lads with nothing but contempt for you. Oh, you never know. They might get caught. Uh, what would be the use? They wouldn't be sorry. I want them to feel sorry, but they won't.
Okay. You take him on the seat as we go. Okay. Gordon, he's been badly beaten up. Thanks a lot. Okay. I've been keeping him still, but his arm's in a bad way. He's on the right thing. Okay, Gordon, let's have a look at you. Right where you're hurting. Casualty receiving. Holby casualty, vehicle inbound, two male, one head injury, one stab wound to chest. Major disturbance on the Maester estate. ETA, ten minutes. Holby casualty all received. Oh God, Maester estate is where that old bloke came from. All right, not long now, Earl. My son is with the others. My, my son, John. He's right here. What were you doing? What do you think you were doing? I heard the noise. I come out to see what was going on. Don't lie to me. Don't lie to me, John. Now you take some more oxygen, Errol. That's it. Now you just lie back. You're proud of yourself now, are you? Oh, son? shut. It's got nothing to do with you. It's got everything to do with me. One of your mates gave my dad a kick in. Well, he got hit, didn't he? Can't oh, you see that? Yeah. These two old blokes done it. Yeah, give him a right eye then. We're going to press charges. Right, if you folks would like to take a seat, I'll take him through and have a look at his injuries. All right, Who do you think nice you're all going about? Do you want him looked at or not? Oh, you think, eh? You deaf or something? Oh, Terry! Oh! 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 There! Oh! 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 Now, bloody look at him. All right, I'll look at him, but not with you. Come on now. Come on, you hurt. Oh, <laughs> you say one word to the police and you're a dead man, all right? Soldier. You rotten little bastard. Come on, take a walk. Go on, it's not nothing. You get out of here. Come on. Get off! I'm sorry about that, sir. What can I say? Why do they hate me so much? What have I done? All right, you just relax. Take nice deep breaths, sir. <laughs> uh, Charlie, that's that ambulance arrival right? okay. Sorry, uh, Sandra, could you uh, keep an eye on this gentleman just till he's settled down a bit? Yeah, sure. What's happened? Okay, this is Errol Wormsley. Received a stab wound to the chest. His uh, BP's okay. gone right through the floor. And his pulse rate has been increasing. My man! Quick! 
What, John Boy? Shaka just threw his hair. How can you stand and look like nothing's happened? You stabbed him, you put a blade in him. That was your old man, did I? It's your protection, John, you saw how it was. You done it. You done it. Come on. Where's my dad? He's been lying. So where are they taking him? Oh, can you give me his name, uh, please? It's all right. It's okay, Claire. Uh, John. Oh, Ash, is the room free for John here? I believe so, yeah. Right, take his dad into crash, stab wound. All oh, right, okay, this way. So do you know anything about it? Yeah. I'm just going to go around here, find out what I can, if you'd like to take a seat. Okay, okay. they find the police? Yeah, I'll do my best. Gordon! Daddy All right, let's sit you down over here. Hey, God, just look at you! It's not as bad as it looks. How's Dad? He's in a right state. Do you know those lads came in here looking for him? I'll kill the bloody You murder. bloody well will not. If you'd have been by his bed instead of out playing cowboys and Indians, this would never have happened. All right, all right, you two. I think the best thing is if we find somebody to take care of Gordon's injuries, <clears throat> don't you? Uh, oh, Sandra. You're yeah, right, Mr. McCauley. Yeah. You build something, so it's right. And these people come along and violate it. So it's not yours anymore. Oh, I'm sorry, it's just... I've had enough. Oh, my God. OK, everybody, this is really important. Could you leave the building by these doors, please? Try not to panic, try not to... OK, this way, please. That's all right. Yeah. Internal cardiac massage. Here we go. Come on. There is no output, Mike. Come on. Mike. Come on. There's nothing. Mike! Oh, shit. You no! did your best, Mike. And I'm sorry I didn't mean so it. Can I didn't mean it. Away. this doctor? Well, I can't say for sure. If he's on this side of the building, I'll come and show you. No, 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 I can't let you do that. You stay there. If he's in there, we'll get in there. Yeah, but who is in there? Rob. No, Rob, follow me on, I'm sure. Dad. <laughs> 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 Well, that's 
son. Um, I'm very sorry, I've got some very bad news for you about your father. He died in the resuscitation meeting shortly before the fire started. They've killed him, haven't they? No, we believe it was a heart attack, you know, it could have happened at any time. I won't forget. I'll find every one of them. You can stop it! Ray's dead! You know, your father really was a very ill man. I know. He drank too much. He used to smell the whiskey on his breath. But this was no way for him to go.